Where am I? Hello? I, uh, how do I get out? I can hear villagers. Oh, wait, I remember now. This is my tomb, but where? Where's everything else? Hello? Wait, where am I? I have no idea where I'm at. Looks like my villager reader has been changed. But where is that? My iron farm stayed the same, it looks like. Let's see. This is completely different. Where am I? I have no idea where I'm at. But I can restart all over again. Wait, is that Journey? Oh, I don't know what you are. You're not Journey. You are tied up, though, so maybe I can have you as my horse to look around. It looks like there are some shulker boxes, and that I'm near a village. This village looks very different from the one that I'm from. So maybe I was transported here? Maybe. But anyways, time to make use of my situation. Hello everyone. This is the Artisan Collective. It's a server that I am part of now because I wanted to join a server. And there are some new faces here. People you've never seen before on my channel. And I'm pretty sure you'll like them all. I'll leave all their channels in the description. And uh, without further ado, let's get going. What are we doing today, you might be asking. Well, I'm about to tell you what we're doing today. Today, where we actually make our trading hall. Because we made the villager breeder and we made an iron farm, which is amazing. This iron farm is awesome. And we can use all that iron for stuff in the future. In fact, we got a few gifts from the server members. Like all this TNT, all these blocks of bamboo, glass, frog lights. I got a silk touch diamond pickaxe from, I believe, Color, Color Tongue. You'll see me in their video, I'm pretty sure. I got some fireworks and an elytra as well. I just need to find out where it, the, yeah, the elytra is over there. I got this from Maze. All these people have been really kind to me. And they got me shulker boxes too. Shulker boxes are actually awesome. Anyways, I have the iron farm running. And I have a lot of iron as well, because why not? Iron is probably one of the most useful things, other than wood. And I do plan on making a wood farm later on, because I do have the TNT for it. I don't need to make another creeper farm. Oh, I can't wait to make one of those again. <laughs> I have enough fireworks, so I won't be needing any gunpowder anytime soon, as well as TNT, which I can just use to make a TNT duper. Oh, and I gotta go horn because there's a there's a future thing coming up in a different artisan's episode that requires lots of goats. So, yep, got this goat horn. We need to. We're, I'm probably gonna make this underground. So let's go and get our armor because I put that all away for the intro. Uh, let's get my bow, my food, pickaxe. I think that's about it. I don't really need my elytra yet. I will take some fireworks in my inventory though. I got a single piece of scaffold. So making a wool farm will be essential. I cannot make the string duper because string dupers are they're illegal on the server. But I can go ahead and get some sheep. So I got some wheat in my hand and I'm gonna go look for some sheep and trap them. And I'm gonna, oh, there's a sheep right over here. Do I have any leads? Follow me sheep. Yup, keep following me. I forget where this goes. It's my mind, it might be my mind. Follow me. Do I have any leads? The lead would be nice. Nope, I'm just gonna need to trap this thing in a pen for now. So let's go mine up this tree. I've been busy planting trees. I've been doing the, the stuff that Mr. Beast does. Team trees. Hello, sheep. I'm gonna need you to come here for a second because I'm gonna make you a little pen to live in and you're gonna get a nice mate. And you guys are gonna have an amazing time. I feel like that should be enough fencing. And then I do the opposite for a fence gate. So, where are we making this pen? Sheep, uh, you know what, stay there for now. I'm gonna dig out this entire land filled with dirt over here so that I can build an actual pen in peace. Oh, this is... I should probably cover that up. If you're wondering why I'm making the area that I'm digging out pretty big, it's because I'm not just gonna be putting sheep in this area. What? Much better. Two, three, four, five. All right, there we go. You're blocked in now, and I need to mine up the center and put a fence gate there. Amazing! I am so good. At you guys aren't supposed to be seeing the beds. How are you still breeding? 
No, stop. Stop. You can no longer see the beds. I don't have any more space for you guys. Look at all the villagers here. Look at it. Why are you guys still breeding? You're going to cause them to suffocate. They can't handle any more people. Damn, that was filled with rage. <laughs> okay, yeah, anyways, there is a sheep in there now. So let's go. Follow me, sheep. Look, you can see... See the wheat in my hand. Behold, I am holding wheat. What are you looking at? Oh, look, there's a cat. I, I just remembered what my future video is gonna be on this server. A lot of people won't like what I did. Yep. Let's put those trees down there, and let's go sleep. Where did you villagers come from? I would like to know where you villagers came from. You aren't supposed to be able to get out without a minecart. How did you guys get out? What if I just make my base an entire system underneath this tomb? This little gravestone. That would be pretty cool. I'm gonna block up this area over here and wait for the iron farm to function while I'm also waiting for the sheeps to finish their cooldown for breeding. So, that should be it for this episode. As you can see, I'm finished with the trading hall. At least for right now. I have all of my emerald villagers, and I'm gonna continue this line of villagers gradually. And then after that, there will be some customization options that I'm gonna add, like iron bars maybe, instead of having this. I'm gonna also cure them off screen and stuff like that. And the next episode, we're planning a bit of netherite. Getting. We're gonna get some netherite, and we're gonna build the village up a little bit. Quick note everyone, I upgraded to netherite. Yep, I did a netherite stream, and then 
upgraded to netherite off camera. As you can see, all of my stuff has been named and enchanted, which is awesome. So it looks like next episode we're going to be building up the village. And I have a new friend to introduce you to. So tune in for our next episode. All right, so see ya. Goodbye. That should be all. So thank you everyone for watching and have a good day. Bye. Bye. Yep, goodbye. See ya.